G'day viewers, uh, just thought I'd do a quick um, bit of content for uh, getting ready to go to the uh, Bright Rod Run this coming Friday. Uh, it's Melbourne Cup Day today, it's pretty miserable uh, here in East Gippsland with the rain and I'm sure a lot of other people have had uh, plenty of rain so we actually can't go over the mountain because uh, of the snow, so Mount Hotham way, so we're looking at alternative uh, uh, routes um, through either, you know, uh, Packenham, Hillsville, up to Benalla sort of way, or it's through the Melbourne, through on the high, high, Hume Highway, which we're, we're trying to avoid. So yeah, just in the shed today, basically, got a chook going on the, spinning on the rotisserie, got the fire going and just got some tunes going on the TV and um, just chillaxing in the shed. Didn't really have a bet today or anything like that, so. But we'll do a bit of a thing on the panel van because I've been sort of getting uh, her ready for the Bright Rod Run this weekend. So the new addition to it, the big one, is the wheels. I uh, just bought some GDS wheels and they came with the trims and centre caps and uh, wheel nuts. Old tyres, but um, we've got some new tyres and I actually had a bloke in Langwire and put the red lines on for me. So, uh, yeah, was stoked with the way that that it brought up a different look of it so pretty happy with that um, so basically the other thing that I've done is give her a uh, service um, I've added the, the old Cluxton horn that the uh, daughter's gonna have fun with that over the weekend I would presume she um, she's got her own button there set up in the, uh, on the dash there so um, yeah just uh, what else have we done to it um, apart from service and just check it over, everything, tyre pressures, they were the old wheels that I had on it, just stockies basically with the white walls and some chrome sort of bullet uh, wheel nuts. Scored this uh, wheel bracket as well, which was handy to get them out of the way um, with the wheels, so I was pretty happy uh, with that. Um, a friend of mine just tidied up the, uh, the rust as they go, just had some bubbles just here, which he tidied that up and just a couple of little bubbles on the tailgate. But um, all in all, uh, yeah, she's, uh, she's a fairly original car otherwise. Uh, I have the books with it, and um, it's a South Australian made car. And it's um, basically, this is the first time it came out of South Australia. I bought it in the second um, COVID lockdown, so, um, yeah, so I've had it for a good couple of years now, um, and I bought it off uh, Robert uh, Classic Car Connect, if everyone does um, know Rob there. So, yeah, he made it look into this sort of rat rod patina look uh, with it, uh, which I quite like that look. And look, I wasn't looking for another car. It was just a uh, impulse buy, which... Uh, I happen to have the money after selling an engine, so um, yeah. So a bit more about the car. It's it's a Kingswood uh, HX 1976 Kingswood uh, panel van. Chamois is the colour of it, uh, and a lady owned it owned it for quite a while and got the few receipts with it and that as well. So um, yeah, factory 253 power steer. It's got the Trimatic. Uh, column shift auto and it's got a Salisbury limited slip 308 ratio uh, diff so it's got yeah got the good package um, from factory but the tailgate that may look like rust but it's it's actually not um, and even the, the um, bottom of that tailgate apart from a, a dent there which adds a, the character to it um, yeah it's um, Pretty good, pretty good nick, even the gutterings, uh, which usually go on these panel vans um, is unbelievable. The, the floors is unreal as well. So inner seals, all that sort of stuff. So the other thing we did do was, so we sort of packed and thrown some spares in and, you know, um, water and hoses and belts and such. So, um, and we put a bit of carpet in, a bit of marine carpet in there yesterday as well. So it's also got the full roof lining in it and um yeah which is good so and um yeah for the, for the interior 
Um, the interior is really good, really good. So um, it's got a oh, fake grass carpet in it at the moment, but I actually have bought some uh, carpet, black carpet to go in there, um, yes, yeah, at some stage. So yeah, the, look, the seat, the seat and everything, the dash, it's all in good nick. Um, yeah, it's unbelievable. Just really good nick. So apart really from that stereo, um, it's pretty well factory. And the, and the, obviously the fake grass as well. So, but yeah, look, it's, it's just, it's just a good all round cruiser. And the good thing I like about these rat rod type, um, vehicles is you just don't have to clean them and worry about them too much. So, and the only other thing I've done as well is put some new brake pads in the front, a uh, new radiator, because it was only due to the, the fins in between the cores were sort of going, but um, yeah, and just put some new hoses and, and belts um, and a new battery, but it's got just so many little things like these little brackets for the hoses and uh, there's a gold plate underneath the carby there that usually goes on oh, the thermostat housing was the other thing in a thermostat just those usual things to uh, look at when um, when it's uh, you know getting on in age so the hoses were all the hard and that sort of thing too so um, just better to replace them but I've driven this car around a bit and it's it's unbelievable just um, Cruises are long runs on an oily rag. Um, as I said, yeah, factory 253, Traumatic Auto and Salisbury Diff. So um, yeah, it's, it's a good all round car and it's just got character. So that is the panel van. So um, yeah, look, there's not much else sort of want to do to it. Um, apart from that carpet, as I said, um, I have tossed up about maybe putting some tunnel rams on it, but look, it just runs really good. So, so she's going to do a uh, trip to Bright um, this weekend. We, like I said, we we've got to go the long way, which is going to probably create a three and a half hour journey to do a seven seven hour journey now. So, uh, but anyway, that's you know that's the brakes and, and it just turns into a cruise so so that's what I'm doing in shed today on the Melbourne Cup uh, 2023 so look I hope you've liked it just uh, yeah if you have like like and um, hit the notification button and subscribe if you like um, so yeah I'm just wrapped with the way those wheels have just turned it turned it around now so anyway have a good day, whatever you're doing, and um, talk, talk to you soon. Cheers.